In the land of the ski hawks, winter days are custom made for winter sports. When the first snow flies, Quebec is a focal point for sportsmen's eyes, the golden treasure at the end of the skier's rainbow. Here, short minutes away from the city itself, are Lac Beauport's sunny snow bowl and the wide open slopes of Valcarche's tumbling terrain. And best of all, Quebec is close at hand for the people who want to join her winter festival and share her holiday mood. She is, in fact, only an overnight trip away from 50 million people. The old walled city has a well-deserved reputation as gracious host, a reputation on the courtesy of her people, on the luxurious hospitality of her famous Chateau Frontenac. Every clear evening or sunny afternoon sees a colorful promenade on the fabled Dufferin Terrace. Some come to enjoy the thrills of the Chateau's breathtaking toboggan run. Some just to watch the broad and varied panorama of fun-loving people against the majestic background of the mighty St. Lawrence River, far below. Whatever their reason for coming, none goes away disappointed. This winter pageant is a combination of sport and social life that all can enjoy. The Chateau's spacious rink claims its good share of people from the happy holiday crew that annually invades Quebec's brilliant winter playground. There's room for every age and every type, for the eager strivings of the small beginner, for the graceful sweeping figures and the sweet rhythmic glides of the more expert devotee of the bright and flashing blade. But there is one prince of winter sports, one thrilling pastime that commands the loyalties of most, and skiing is that prince. No one is too young to start to learn, no one too old to continue to enjoy it. It is the beginning and the ending of sport for countless thousands, and each year more and more agree. There's freedom here. There's the whistle of wind and the spray of snow the tingling thrill of stealing a ride on old King Winter's broad white shoulders. High on the wooded slopes, the snow lies deep, and the sun shines bright through the crisp, clear days between Christmas and Easter. Powder snow it is, and plenty of it, King Winter's generous gift to skiers. The best way to find your fun on skis is to learn the tried and true technique that experts use. Even the newest beginner can find that fun quickly under the guidance of the famous Fritz Loosley and his corps of ski hawk school instructors. This is where parallel skiing is taught, taught and learned the easy way, the way that means fun from the start. Fledglings try their wooden wings on gentle slopes at first under the watchful eye of an expert. Balance is the thing and rhythm. Balance and rhythm and the wish to fly fast and free. And it can be done. Not many lessons stand between the beginner and the swinging, gliding freedom of the steeper, speedier slopes. Now he's a beginner no longer. Now he can go where he likes on skis, safe, sure, a full partner in sport's most thrilling adventure. And now, with a few lessons behind him, the skier is on the way toward mastery of his sport. Practice is what he wants now, and practice he can get on the limitless slopes of the high Valcartier Ridge. The long run down, the quick trip up. The skier has the fun, the ski toe does the work.
But that's not all the fun to be found when skiers gather between powdery snow and clear sky. There's the keen companionship of fellow sportsmen, the refreshing pause, a welcome snack, and the sharp, sweet pleasure of soaking up golden sunshine and crisp winter air. And sometimes there's a chance to see a real master of the sport in action, as when Fritz Loosely and his instructors from the Chateau Frontenac's famous Ski Hawk School pick up the challenge that is thrown at their feet by such terrain as this. It is a good two miles run to the valley below, a vertical drop of nearly a thousand feet, ski country that can't be surpassed. It's the fabulous, famous Valcarche. It's the land of the Ski Hawks. It's a skier's dream come true, a billowing, rolling paradise of powdery snow. And there's no law against catching a ride on a cloud. That's what skiing can be like, that's what skiing is when the snow lies deep, when the hills rise high above the valleys. That's what skiing is when you ski at Quebec. And when the day begins to fade, when the air grows chill at last, and the thought of refreshments and a warm fire begins to be appealing, there's the Chateau Frontenac's comfortable, cheery Ski Hawk Club, where only skiers gather. <laughs> to tell and songs to sing and friendships to cement. There is tomorrow, another day of skiing. Mm -hmm.